Hey y'all, it is two weeks away from turkey season here in Kentucky and I've got my shotgun here with me because uh, it's got a brand new ch turkey choke in and we're going to go outside and pattern it. Uh, if you follow us on Instagram, uh, by the way, if you're not doing that already, I'm going to put the info in the description below. Uh, but it's at the underscore quack underscore addicts. You can stay up to date with us on there. I post pretty much every day. But um, like I said, if you follow us on there, you'll know that just the other day this package come in from Rob Roberts uh, Custom Gunworks. It's a, uh, a Goblin Thunder 655 Constriction Turkey Choke. Uh, that's I talked to the guys down there and they recommended that I shoot a 655 out of this 24 inch barrel gun. Uh, it's a Benelli M2. Uh, it's what I shoot during duck season and everything. So it's uh, just three inch shells. But I'm shooting heavy shot magnum blends. And uh, I'm really anxious to see what kind of pattern that it throws. Uh, so we're going to run over to my granddad's house. He has some uh, turkey targets over there for patterning. And uh, we're going to grab some targets from him. And I uh, want to introduce y'all to him really quick. He's one of the biggest hunters that you'll ever meet. Pretty much taught me everything I know. Taught me to be a good sportsman and, you know, uh, gun safety. Uh, between him and my dad, you know, my dad taught me all kinds of things too, but uh, Papa taught my dad. So, uh, you can always learn a little something something from the older guys. Uh, get those words of wisdom. So, we're going to run over there really quick and... Uh, grab some targets, and then uh, we're going to go from there. It's raining outside, so I'm hoping that it lets up before we try to shoot my gun. We've got a couple hours left before it gets dark, so maybe it will. Uh, all right, let's get after it. Y'all see what I see, guys? I got over here at Memo and Papa's house, and there's a gobbler in the backyard. There's a couple jakes with them too. Man, that's got me pumped up. Uh, this is my mamma and papa. He had a target sitting here. It's one of those nice shoot and see ones. Uh, you can set up the cardboard or whatever and then paste the target to it. So we should be able to count how many pellets are in the head pretty easy that way. So. How many pellets do you think is good in the kill zone anyway from 40 yards? 40 yards is probably about 15 to 20. You think so? Yeah. You can get more than that in it, but you know. We'll see. From I'm 40, sure. it, it really widens it out a little bit. Don't you? Yeah. Well. Just practice all. I always, most time I always pattern my gun every year. Even, really? Yeah, every year. Just because <laughs> you get excited about turkey season? Or no, what? Or just, just because I'm going to make sure something has changed. Most of it will be off a little bit. You might have hit it on something or something. Oh, you're talking about if you're using a scope? No. If you, you know, just for your sight. Oh, really? Yeah, that, that, that barrel will bend easy on you. Huh. I mean, you know, if you hit it hard or something, it might knock, might it, knock it off a little bit. I didn't think about that. No, huh. I used to use, you know, Go for it all the time. Yeah. But, uh, me and him's planning on getting out and doing some hunting at the beginning of the season, so hopefully that'll work out. Uh, I'm pretty excited about it. That gobbler in the backyard got me pretty fired up for season. Foxy? <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to go shoot my gun. You better get late. Yeah. <laughs> well, guys, I think that's going to do. Uh, we run out here at 40 yards and we're going to take a shot at this. It's starting to rain a little bit, so uh, I'm going to try to hurry this up. All right, guys, got a heavy shot Magnum blend. Uh, shooting through a Rob Roberts uh, 655 choke out of my Benelli M2. See what it does. We're at 40 yards right now. I think that's pretty dead on.
check that out. I hadn't counted it yet. So, uh, yeah, that's a pretty good pattern. Let's, uh, let's run inside really quick and count it in there because it's starting to rain out here. I kind of want to get my camera gear in. There it is, y'all. I feel like those are some pretty good results, just to be honest. Uh, let's count them really quick. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So from here up in the head and neck area, 30 pellets. That's not bad. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. 37 pellets total right there in the kill zone. So I like it. I like it a lot. This new this new choke is awesome. I don't know. There might be someone out there getting a better pattern than this, but I mean, that's definitely going to do the job at 40 yards. And I don't plan to shoot a turkey over 40 yards myself. Uh, so yeah. Guys, thank you so much for following me around today and uh, watching me pattern this gun and meeting my grandparents. Uh, like I said, he is pretty much my inspiration to do this. So, uh, guys, I'm out of here for today. If you're not already following us on social media, go check us out. Like I said, we have an Instagram and a Facebook. I'm more active on Instagram. Uh, I post pretty much every single day. So uh, you can keep up with us that way. Uh, but for now, I'm out. Two weeks till turkey season, guys. I don't know about y'all, but I am excited. I'll see y'all then.